A student at Jenison High School is trying to change the school's dress code, and her petition is just under a thousand signatures. 39er Sides Kylie Ambu sat down with her today to talk about how she plans to bring change. I go to school to learn, and if we get pulled out of the classroom, we're not learning. We're missing out on opportunities in the classroom to thrive. At almost 15 years old, Kimberly Smalligan is no stranger to the dress code at Jenison Public Schools. I've been dress coded multiple times. I get called down to the office, brought out of class because of what I'm wearing. Her last run in with the rules happened the school year after she was disciplined for wearing this. They didn't care about the shoulders, but it's in their rule book too. They were saying that my stomach was showing too much and that it was distracting. The sophomore says the experience was frustrating and distracted from her education. I was called out right in front of my friend and said, like I was yelled at. It was not nice. Later taking her concerns online, she started a petition to relax some of the rules, which she says unfairly targets girls over boys. One time in the sixth grade, we were in health class and something was brought up about dress code and the teacher said it was something in the male brain that made shoulders distracting and she said we had to cover ourselves up and be modest. Smalligan's petition has racked up almost 1,000 signatures, but not without pushback from the community. One person even starting a petition of their own to keep the rules the same. In a statement to 13 on your side, Jenison Public Schools said the school encourages students to dress for success while promoting a positive learning environment. While Kimberly says she's not trying to take down the school or even the dress code as a whole. I do not want to get rid of it completely because obviously people need boundaries but I think we needed at least an inch and a half of stomach and shoulders. She says she does want to start a conversation with school leaders to create a more equal experience. In Jenison, Kylie Ambu, 13 on your side.